All right, we are back. This is 2008, uh, 18, 2018. Uh, we are in Hollywood Oscar night at the Next Door Lounge. And we are right down the street from the Oscar Oscars where all the actions happen on Highland. And actually there's more action happening here at this party than at the actual Oscars. Because when the Pod Brother gets down to Hollywood, it's a big deal. As you can see, we got like this place is packed. Uh, I want to thank Brad Chite for throwing this amazing party. We had the red carpet out front. We've got beautiful bodies and smart brains and talented people. And uh, why stop there? We have the luxurious, the incredible, the influencer, the motivator, and the inspire. I have Dr. Kathleen Rosenblatt on the show with me today. How are you, love? Very good, Kimberly. Very good to be here. Man, I tell you, whenever you walk in the room, it's like sunshine. <laughs> well, you know, we all have a solar plexus. We could all be shining a lot brighter. Yeah, I got to get out my <laughs> so, sunscreens, you know, yeah. when you come in the room, because, you know, I got to get my sunblock going, because you got it going on like that. Oh, it's, I'm so glad you could make it out to the party tonight. It's great. It's great. It's wonderful seeing it on the big screen. And yeah, yeah. A lot of great people here tonight. Yeah, it's just so much fun. You got like, you know, just the, uh, just the energy of, of the talent and the ambition and just the bright-eyed, uh, bushy-tailed ambition. You know, just the hope. The hope in this room is huge. That's right. And the room itself is a beautiful structure. I Isn't love cool? these tall ceilings and these chandeliers. It's really gorgeous. It's, it's charming. It's kind of Very like, charming. It feels like a speakeasy. Yes, yes. You know, it's yeah. like the 1929, you know, I'm mm -hmm. waiting for Al Capone to come in right. the door right now. But a grand speakeasy. You yeah, know? yeah, <laughs> no, it's, it's super, super cool. Very nice. So you got a couple things going. I know you, uh, you're you promoting uh, a, a book about acupuncture. I know you're expert in the field. You are traveling the globe doing lectures and speeches and, and demonstrations about um, acupuncture. Yes. Uh, tell us a little bit about what you have going. Well, I've been lecturing in Paris, uh, and my talk in French or in English <laughs> is called The Human Electromagnetic Laser Body, because that's what we have. Mm -hmm. You know, these things we call acupuncture meridians have all all the quality, qualities, all the characteristics of a laser beam, so that when people get it, that they're really la light beings. You know, that's not a metaphor, but that's really closer to the truth. You know, the actual scientific makeup of our body is more about, you know, bio photons and uh, energies. And so, once you get that, then you understand why acupuncture works. You know, why it does miracles because it's dealing with the underpinnings. It's dealing with more than deeper than the plumbing it's dealing with the electrical wiring and uh, the energy lines of the body so so finally um, Dr. Steven Rosenblatt uh, ro finally published his book called The Birth of Acupuncture in America because that's what really started in our living room decades ago we started the first legal clinic in the country at UCLA mm -hmm. and the first organization the National Acupuncture Association and uh, a lot of, you know, we just sort of laid the groundwork. He did the first doctoral thesis on acupuncture, and it was on acupuncture and brain waves. So it was wow. really, really a big shift in understanding. That's cool. So, and so you are also on faculty, on staff for um, the first doctorate program in acupuncture. I don't know if it's the first, but we are reviving the college that we started back in the 80s. Oh, actually, in the 70s, excuse me, the California Acupuncture College. And so we're reviving it online in cooperation with Akamai University in Hawaii. And we are offering a doctoral program for acupuncturists that are already, you know, graduated. And so that's very exciting because um, we're taking it to another level now. We're taking the whole field to another level. There are other programs out there for the same, you know, uh, aim, but this one I think is going to be really good. That's awesome, and it's an eighteen-month program. That's right. That's right. And so it's for acupuncturists. Now anyone could take the classes, but if you want to get this degree, but it's also good for acupuncturists that need continuing education credits. So they can they take could, some of the courses yes. for continuing ed and that's uh, right. re, You know, keep their license current and that's right. things that's like that. Right. Oh, that's that's very very cool. And I'm going to be teaching a class about how to deal with sexual harassment. 
you know, for everyone involved, whether it's the victim or the perpetrator, all the issues that are involved with this is really a huge thing. And I've been working on this for years, but now suddenly we have the Me Too movement. Yeah, so it's an very awareness. timely. Yeah, there's a know. consciousness that's happening that's right now. That's right. So that's very exciting. Well, that's cool that you can bring something to the table that can help with that. Right. That, I, the, the I had already created uh, a CD for stress relief, and then I made a special version for veterans with PTSD. And so this is one of the first forms of meditation where it's in, incorporating the whole body, including every cell of the body. So I call it cellular meditation because every cell of the body has a little brain and a little emotional center, and it has a hundred receptor sites for feel-good opiates. Who knew that we're full of opiates? We should feel, be feeling really good in our skin. But most people, it's so dormant that they don't feel good in their skin and they have to go find chocolate cake or, or sex or new shoes or something to fill them up because they're not getting those endorphins working. I feel good in my skin. I know, you do, you do. But a lot of people don't. It's, you know, it's a lost art. And it's been suppressed for you know, a thousand years. You know? We've been taught to... Uh, hold uh, suffering as a greater good and pleasure is kind of questionable. So we've got to turn that around. We've got to feel good in our skin. So we don't need to impose on anyone else. We don't need to buy something. We can feel good and then we can proceed. Well, it makes you responsible for your own happiness. You're not like projecting that on somebody else. That's right. And Which they would never in a million years be able to do. <laughs> That's impossible. You right. know, it's, it's like you kind of you right. have to do that for yourself right. in a lot of ways. I mean, it's nobody's fault in a way because we've been programmed in our culture to always go for drama, always go for conflict, and look at our life as drama and conflict instead of just enjoying and feeling good and turning on those endorphins. You know, with just a little bit of, of personal inter intervention, interface with the body, you know, the, letting the mind go through the body. Awesome. Otherwise, we're cut off at the top. We don't want that. No, no, no cutting off at the top. Right. Well, I am so excited. that. Did you get a chance to get on the red carpet outside? And, no, uh, no, I didn't. Okay. We just well, walked I, right in. I think they're still out there. So, you know, yeah. if they are, you probably should get a little mic time out there. Okay. All right. Because that's another uh, media outlet that has a lot of eyeballs and a lot yeah. of, you know, I think they have a decent audience that can uh, get your message. Okay. That sounds and, like fun. And your love and your... Uh, your inspiration about uh, uh, enjoying being in your own skin. Yes. Okay. Sweet. Well, where can we find on. you online? Where is the? Well, my uh, website is called brainbodybliss.com. You know, Dr. Kathleen R at brainbodybliss.com is my email, but the website is brainbodybliss, which is what we should all get to enjoy. And your uh, Instagram is, is Dr. Kathleen Rosenblatt or is it Brain Body Bliss? <laughs> it's one of those. <laughs> yes, one of those. <laughs> I think if you go to uh, Instagram and just plug your name in, you're, you will pop up. I think up. so. I think yeah. so. That's true. All right. Well, thank you for stopping right, by the Pod welcome. Brothers Show okay. and thanks for coming by and, and enjoying the yeah. uh, Oscar viewing party. Party on. Party on. <laughs> All right, there you go. This is Pod Brother here in Hollywood. Thanks for uh, hanging with us. We're going to get some more people, have some more fun. And, uh, man, it's on and cracking. Brad's going through with drinks, so everyone loves him. And that's where you hear all the women screaming, because Brad's kind of going through the crowd with, like, shots of something cool. Uh, maybe, we need, maybe we should try to get him over here. Brad! All right, we'll be right back. <laughs>